Hello everyone, welcome back to IB's YouTube channel. My name is Ishani and I'm one of the trainers for Power BI at IB. So today we're going to talk about a follow-up video from the last week in which we spoke about creating hierarchy from the fields of the same table. And this was the resultant. We had uh, created a hierarchy of continent, regions and the country. Now today what we will do is we'll talk about how to create a similar structure, but using the fields from a different table. So over here, this is a data set in which I have on the top level, I've got categories. So uh, let's go to the table to understand it better. So I've got the category table in which I've got the category name. So for example, higher level bikes are there, accessories are there. Now, within the categories, there are subcategories which are present. So, if I click here, I can see like mountain bikes, under bikes, there's mountain bike, road bikes, touring bikes, under accessories, there would be handlebars, brakes, chains, and so on and so forth. And then further bifurcation of it is on the product table. So, when you look at the product table, it also talks about not only the subcategory, but the actual product SKU, the description of the product is also given over here. So now, you know, typically in the business, we would like to understand our, let's say profits or the quantities or the sales on the highest level first. And then we would like to drill down. Now the issue is that if I create a hierarchy like we created last time, if I go over here and if I go to the categories, and let's say I say right click, create hierarchy, just like last time. All right. Now, if I go to properties and at the bottom where I can add the fields, if I click here, I'm only getting the fields which are associated to this particular table. So the question is, how do I get fields from the other table? Now, in order to achieve this fields from the other table, very important is that the tables are related properly. So this view that you're looking at is a data model view in which there is a relationship creating between the different tables that are there in the data set. Once your data models are ready, then we can go ahead and create the hierarchy. Now, how will it work? Since Power BI does not allow me to bring fields from the other tables, what we are going to do is put the fields required from the other tables in one single table. What I mean to say is I have got products over here. So if I'm able to bring the, the category name and the subcategory name in the product table, I will be able to create a hierarchy over here. So let's begin. Now, like I said, the very important thing is data models. If the data models, if the tables are not connected, you cannot achieve the outcome of it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a function called related and create a DAX function using a calculated column. And over here, <coughs> I'm going to bring the product name. Product name is there. We're going to get the category name. So category name, we'll use related. What related does is helps us to bring information from the tables which are having relationship into another table. And what I want is category name. Press enter and you will see, we'll get a column over here with the category names. All right. Next, just like how we got categories, we would also like to bring the subcategories over here. We'll do a very similar thing, subcategory and related subcategory name, close the bracket, enter. And now we've got the subcategory. Now that we've got everything in the table 
in which we wanted to create it, let's go ahead and repeat the process. Again, I'm going to go to the category table, right click on the category name, create, All right, let's go back to our property windows. Scroll down. We can give the name like we did in the previous window a video. And now we want to add level. So I want to add, uh, okay, I did it in the wrong place. Hold on one second. It should not be in the category table. Rather, it should be in the product table because that's where we got everything in. So I'm going to go to the product table, <coughs> click on the category name in the product table and create it. All right, now it's done correctly. Let's scroll down to its category name. Then I would need my subcategory called added and then I need my product name and done. Let's supply level changes. And let's look at the outcome. So I have got category name, subcategory, and the product name. Perfect. Let's implement. So I'm going to use again a matrix. All right. And I am going to drop the category name, the hierarchy. And let's say we want to look at it at this time using quantity, right? So we've got category name and the quantity. And if I drill down, now I have in the accessories, what are the subcategories, under pipe, what are the subcategories? And we can further drill down from subcategory even to the product name. So this is how we can mix the fields of different tables and create one single hierarchy. So I hope you enjoyed this video and you were able to follow through the steps. For more such videos, make sure you subscribe to IB Professional Schools channel. Thank you. Thank you.